Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi, I'm Taylor and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be taking you guys with me to shop at TJ Maxx and Marshalls. I take you guys with me to shop at TJ Maxx and Marshalls and Burlington's every single week. So today I will be showing you all the high-end makeup I can find at TJ Maxx and Marshalls for a really cheap price. So if you guys are interested in seeing what I found, just keep watching. Also, in my last TJ Maxx and Marshalls video, I had a giveaway, so I will be announcing the winner of the giveaway in the comments down below. I was giving away a TJ Maxx $25 gift card, so if you want to see who the winner is, I will have that um, pinned down below in a comment. Before we start the video, don't forget to hit that like button down below and subscribe to my channel because I would love to have you. Also, make sure your post notifications turned on so you don't miss an upload. And let's start this TJ Maxx and Marshall Shop With Me video. The first thing that I seen was this Estee Lauder Bronze Goddess Highlighter. So this is pretty similar to the um, bronzer I got there. Same um, collection, but this is a highlighter and it was for $24.99. Next was some more Estee Lauder. This is a um, blush, pure color Envy. Um, usually this is around $38, but it was only $14.99 here at TJ Maxx. Next is this NARS foundation. This is the Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation. This was around $49 on their website, but it was only $9.99 here at TJ Maxx. Um, and I believe this is like a newer foundation for NARS. Um, next is this Bare Mineral Highlighter. It was only $10.99, but on their website, it was around $29, I believe. Next, I did find some Lime Crime, and this is like the first time I've really found um, that brand at TJ Maxx. Anyways, at my TJ Maxx. Um, this is like a highlighting palette. It was $14.99. This is the Blossoms one. And then also I did find that same highlighting palette in the Opals um, one. And these were, I think they were on sale on their website, but usually these are around $30. So this is a pretty good deal. They're super pretty. Next was this metallic palette by Sephora. Um, it was $28 on Sephora's website, and it was a lot. These colors are really pretty, um, but it was only $9.99 here at TJ Maxx. Next, we have some Milani. This is Prep and Soothe Camilla um, Oil. So it looked to me like this was had been replaced with a different um, one on their website. I could not find this product, so I believe it has been discontinued. Um, but it was only $3.99 here at TJ Maxx. Next, we have this Olay Total Effect 7-in-1 Anti-Aging Eye Cream. And as well, I could not find this one online anywhere, so I believe it has been discontinued. Next, we do have some No Pore Blum Primer. Um, I really do like this primer. I did pick one of these up at TJ Maxx a long time ago, um, and it's really good. It was only $9.99, and usually I think it's like $20 on their website or at Ulta. Um, next, we have some more Bobbi Brown. This is the Nude Finish Tinted Moisturizer. This product is actually $48 on their website, but it was only $19.99 here at TJ Maxx, so that's a really good deal. Um, a lot of these Bobbi Brown and other higher-end products are really good deals, like half off the product here at TJ Maxx. Next, we do have some more Bobbi Brown. This is a foundation. It was around $50 on their website and it was only $17.99 here at TJ Maxx. Next, we do have um, a Bobbi Brown foundation stick. Um, this was also around $50 on their website, but was only $16.99 here at TJ Maxx. And again, some more Bobbi Brown. This is the Sheer Finish Loose Powder. This was around $44 on their website, and it was only $17.99 here at TJ Maxx. So a lot of those Bobbi Brown products are really good deals. Next, we have this MAC Strobe Cream. Um, this was in the shade Silver Light, and it was, these are usually like $35 on MAC.com, but it was only like $9.99 here at TJ Maxx. Next was some Marc Jacobs. This is the Omega Glaze um, Luminizer. So this product was on sale at Sephora, but it was still cheaper here at TJ Maxx. Thank you. 
Next, we have a little bit newer brand I have never seen at T at my TJ Maxx anyways. Um, I've rarely seen this, but this is a highlighter. I'm not even going to attempt to say the brand because I'm going to say it horribly, but it was only $4.99, and at Sephora, this highlighter was $30. Next, we do have a Becca mini highlighter. This is not a full-size highlighter. This is just the mini one. Um... It was only $5.99, so that's a really good deal for a Becca highlighter, even the mini one. Next, we do have this. They, they had a lot of this brand right here today. Um, I'm not going to even attempt to say it either, but this is a highlighter in the shade White something, and this was $7.99 here at TJ Maxx. Next, we do have some Laura Geller. This is a baked um, swirl illuminator. This was around $18 on the website, but it was only $3.99 here at TJ Maxx. And then next, we do have a Becca set. Um, they don't have this set for sale anymore. I think it, the sticker on it says it's a, like compared to around $20, um, but there's just a little blur kit. There's two products in it. Um, and it's like a powder and a highlighter, uh, I mean a primer, I think. And it was only $7.99. Next, we do have some more of this brand right here. This is the Miss Piggy collection. I actually did not even know they had a Miss Piggy collection, so I thought this was super cute. This is like a blush palette. Um, it was $9.99 here at TJ Maxx. Next, again in that same brand, we have a dewy stick. Um, this is like a highlighting stick. It was around $20 on their website, but it was only $4.99 here at TJ Maxx. So that's a really good deal. And it looked like a really pretty highlighting shade. And again, we do have some more of that brand. This is a marbled, it's marbled light. It's a blush, illuminating blush. So it was $4.99 and on their website, they did have it currently on sale for $13. Um, but normally it was way more expensive. Next, we do have some more of that brand. This is a foundation. This does retail for around $20 on their website. And it was only here at TJ Maxx for $7.99. And then next, we did have some Cover FX. I haven't seen this um, brand at TJ Maxx in a while. This is the Custom Cover Drops. They were $29 on Cover FX website. But they were only $6.99 here at TJ Maxx. And it looks to be like it was a lighter um, shade. And then again, some more cover up FX. This is the Power Play Concealer. This is a actually $30 concealer normally. And it was here at TJ Maxx for only $5.99. So that's a really, really good deal. Next, we have some CoverGirl um, lip. This is lid paint. So it's like a liquid eyeshadow, basically. And it was only $3.99. And this was a discontinued product. I could not find it online anywhere. Next, we do have some Care Beauty. This is the Wildflower Palette. This palette does retail for $12 on their website, but it was only $5.99 here at TJ Maxx. And it was some really pretty shades. I actually wish I would have got this palette. Um, next, we have a Care Beauty Daydream Palette. And I actually did buy this palette, and I did a whole video um, on this palette. You can go back on my channel and check it out. Um, but it was only $5.99, and this palette is really good. The eyeshadows work really good, and the colors are really pretty. Now we have some more Care Beauty. This is an eyeshadow palette called Party Girl. Um, it was $15.99 on their website, but it was only $5.99 here at TJ Maxx. So it's a really good deal. And again, these Care Beauty eyeshadow palettes are all super, super pretty. Um, the shadows look really good, and they actually work really good. And now we have this another um, palette for $15.99 normally, but it was only $5.99 again like the last one. Now we have this Pacifica eyeshadow palette. This is a tiger's eye palette. This is actually hemp infused eyeshadows. It does retail for around $10 at Ulta Beauty, um, but I believe it was around, yeah, $5.99 here at TJ Maxx. Now we have some more of this. This is a, I'm not even gonna say it, Boxdom um, Tiki Bar Palette. This is like a cheek palette. It was only $16.99 here at TJ Maxx. Next, we do have this BH Cosmetics eyeshadow palette, and this actually was a discontinued palette. Um, it was $6.99. Next, we have this um, 
brand again. This is a must-haves lip and lash kit. It does say it retails for around $15. Or it's a $23 value, I think. And then it was on... They actually didn't have a price on it. Next, we have a Smashbox Camera Ready eyeshadow brush. This is a blending eyeshadow brush. This eyeshadow brush retails for $24. Um, but it was only $9.99 here at TJ Maxx. So that's a pretty good deal. It's really expensive for an eyeshadow brush, I personally think, for $20, but um, maybe it works really, really well. Next, we have this Morphe brush. This is the M143. Um, it was actually, it's like more of like a mini brush, I would say. Next, we have this BH Cosmetics um, dual cleansing pad. This is like a pad you use to clean your brushes on and stuff. It was $3.99 at TJ Maxx, and it was actually only $3.50 on BH Dots bh website so it was actually cheaper on their website than it was here at tj maxx and that rarely happens <laughs> next we have uh, we are at marshall's now and this is a sephora lip set it was around 15 dollars. i believe this was around christmas time it's actually a discontinued product that's on sale here at marshall's for only 5.99 next you guys can see there are a ton of mac lipsticks here at um marshall's and they were only 7.99 they had a ton of different colors next we have this becca um product this is like a lip product in the shade blackberry i think it said and it was only 6.99 but this product was actually a discontinued lip product next we do have this becca lipstick um it looks like it's in a really pretty um reddish pinkish shade for $6.99 and we do have a Anastasia Beverly Hills lip gloss and it is in the shade Venus and it was only $5.99 so it's a really good deal I think ABH lip gloss is usually around $20 Next, we do have this Laura Mercier um, lipstick. This is in Rogue Profound. Um, it's a pretty red color. It was $9.99. These usually go for around $30 on their website. Next, we have a e.l.f. lipstick. This one is Day to Night Lipstick Duo. Um, this goes for around $5 on e.l.f.com, but it was only $2.99 here at Marshalls, and it was a, also a really pretty red color. Next, we do have this pack of three Burt's Bees um, tinted lip balms. Um, on Amazon, just one of them was $9.99. On, at Marshalls, you could get three of them for $7.99. Next was this Buxom uh, Duo. This was a powerful prep and party duo for $14.99. And this was a discontinued product. They no longer had it on their website. Um, it did have two different ones in there. Next, we have some Pacifica. This is a all-light multi-mineral BB cream for $5.99 here at Marshalls. And then we did find some Morphe foundation also here at Marshalls. Um, this is the older Morphe foundation. It is on their website for $7, um, but it was here at Marshalls for $5.99 so it's a really good deal and they did have quite a few shades at my Marshalls. Um, next we have another Buxom palette. This is a Boss Babe Betty palette. Um, it's really pretty like browns and neutral colors. The palette was $16.99. Then next we have this um, right here. This is a Rachel Zoe Times Lorac uh, set. This is actually a lipstick set. Um, they actually no longer have these. It is also discontinued. Now we have some Marc Jacobs Cafe. This is a um, caffeine concealer and foundation. On Sephora's website, it is $20, but it was here at Marshall's for $14.99. And we have some more Becca. This Becca is a um, Hydra Mist Set and Refresh Powder. It was at Sephora for $19 on sale, but it was here at Marshall's a lot cheaper. And this powder is really good, and it is actually really refreshing. Um, I have tried it. Now we have some Sephora Collection Lashes. They're around $20 on Sephora's website, but they're only $8.99 here at Marshall's. 
Now we do have a couple cream shop items. So this first one right here, it is Angel Face Powder Highlighting Duo. One side was purple, one side was yellow. This was $4.99. And then we do have another cream shop, uh, Angel Face Powder Highlighting Duo. Um, it was also $4.99 and usually it is $12 on their website. Um, next we have this Cream Shop Toasty Cushion Bronzer. On their website, it is is go selling for twenty dollars, but it is on sale at Marshalls for five ninety nine. And then the last thing I found was another set of lashes. These are House of Lashes Iconic False Lashes. They are twelve dollars at Ulta, but they're only four ninety nine here at Marshalls. All right, guys, that is all I have for you in today's video. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button down below and subscribe, and stay tuned for future um, giveaways for TJ Maxx and Marshalls. And I'll see you guys in my next video.